got something really awesome for Christmas that I am so excited about that I actually meant to put on my Christmas list and forgot to. And it turns out my dad ended up buying it for me anyway and he like already had it to give me for Christmas so it all worked out. But that is an arrow garden. So this is an arrow garden. It's like a little indoor garden so you can grow greens. Um, they've got some like flowers, herbs, vegetables. And we have one at the nature center that works amazingly to grow lettuces for our turtles. And so I really wanted one for my animals. I've been meaning to look up and see if they had the good greens that I feed to grow in the arrow garden. So like collard greens, turnip green, mustard green, dandelion green, like all those good greens because the arrow garden comes with like your everyday lettuces, which I don't really feed. You know, they're a fun thing to like add in, but they don't really provide much in the way of nutritional benef benefits. So once I got the arrow garden for Christmas, I hopped on their website and thankfully it was like Christmas day, so they did have sales going on. So not only are we opening the arrow garden, but I also have another package to open from them. And these are the greens that I ordered. So I ordered, because they did have like collard green and mustard green and everything and turnip green I think so I ordered a bunch of really good greens to put in the arrow garden so now that this is here and enclosures have been moved around my room I have like two spots that I could set this up I want to set it up up here next to Samoa's enclosure because it's a big open space with nothing there I have nothing to put there except maybe some plants so we're gonna see what fits there otherwise I have like a little nightstand kind of little thing under my TV that I could put it on so we're gonna try and see where I can put it but first we're just gonna open it up to start with I am so excited about this okay no my bed is not made just ignore it that's not the point of this video the point of this video is to open this bad boy up so let's go ahead and do that so I'll pull it right out so this one comes with, you can see it right here, it comes with a, um, see if I can pronounce these, Black Seeded Simpson, Deer Tongue, Paris Island, Marvel, Four, Marvel, Marvel of Four Seasons, there we go, R Rogue De Hiver, I'm not even gonna, no, we're gonna keep going, and Red Sails. So there's a bunch of different lettuces. Um, so I'll probably put in a couple of these as well as the greens that I feed out. So here it is. It's not too big. Cute little thing. We're gonna go ahead and finish opening it up. Take it out. If I can. All right, so this is what it looks like. You've got the spots for your plants there. This is a like a grow light for them. And then you've got your little things down here that light up. So it lights up to tell you when you need to add water, if you need to add food, and then you've got your light on and off. And then there's a little compartment here that you lift up to put in water or food or whatnot. And look, that whole thing comes off apparently. Back to the box. Um, no? Does it not come with anything? Okay, it said it comes with six pods. I don't see any pods anywhere. Nothing else in the box. I've got the instructions. So, there are a couple different types of arrow gardens. I have the harvest, so this one over here. Um, there's also the Harvest 360 and the Harvest Slim. So mine's just, you know, the little normal guy. Six spots for growing. Well, I don't see any pods, so we're gonna go ahead and open up the package that I ordered. And just keep trucking right along. Um, I need some scissors. Ah, big box for just a little kit. Alright, so... I did do the custom salad kit, so you can either order kits, um, or you can do a custom salad kit, so you pick which ones you want. I did the custom because I wanted to get some of the uh, different greens. So it's a 12 pod kit, so I got to pick 12, 12 uh, different 
hang the tape off. 12 different pods for growing. There we go. Okay. So there's the pods. This is what they look like. So this one is a bok choy. That's what I got. I got bok choy. Um, mustard green. Collard green. Bok choy. Mustard green. So maybe that's all I got. Mustard green, collard green, and bok choy. Um, see that paper here. There's little cups. And let's just pull this out. Seed pod kit instructions. Add water, drop in pre-seeded pods, add plant food, and yeah. So this must be, this must be the plant food. So let's see. Yep. So here, this is what the plant food looks like. It just comes in this little bottle. You know, nothing too crazy. Open it up. I can remove the tin foil, but then you just pour some in. Boom. Good to go. Alright, so I'm gonna see if this fits where I kind of want to put it. And I'm also gonna take a look and see if I can find the pods that are supposed to come with mine. I did open it on Christmas, but then I put it back in the box, and I don't remember seeing any pods. So we're gonna look around. So I'll be back with you guys in just a minute. Okay, so it does fit up here. I also extended the light because this is adjustable, so I brought it up a little bit. It can still go up a little bit more. I would just have to move this forward, but since they're just gonna be paused for now, you don't want it too high. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and plug it in. Oh, and I did find the greens um, that come with it. So it's just this heirloom salad greens. Um, so six pod kit that comes with it. So I realized I was also missing the plug. So they were all in my bag of Christmas presents that I haven't put in away yet. So, or put away yet, excuse me, English. Um, so yeah, those are the greens that come with it. And we're gonna go ahead and get it all plugged in. So I just plug it into the back. I'm gonna have to run the cord down the back. Somehow, actually, I think I have a plug up here. So I'll have to grab my uh, handy dandy step stool. Now it just turned on. Okay, next step. So fill to indicator. Oh, it says inside, there's a little thing that says fill to here. Oh, so they each have like little water spouts where water runs out. Very fancy. So we're gonna do one of each of these. So here's a Swiss chard. I'm going to put the good greens on one side and the snack greens on the other. So there's Swiss chard. Collard's pretty tall, so we're going to put collard in the back, and then I need a bok choy. And then we're going to put the little caps on. Okay, and then now for some snacky greens just to mix it up. And if they have these, I might as well use them. Then you see right on them where it says the size of the plant and how long it takes for them to sprout. So this is a medium plant and it sprouts in four to eight days. So we're gonna stick that in. So the Paris Island, a deer tongue, and we'll go with red sails. So these are all medium. These all say medium in five to 10 days. The collard is 14 to 21 days. Dang. Yep, that one's going in the back. Oh, and then we've got to put our little grow caps on. Oh, oh no, oh no. Stay on. Stay on. Stay on. Okay. Next up, add plant food. Follow feeding instructions on the plant food bottle. Okay. Okay, so we have six to seven pods. 
8 milliliters or 2 capfuls at startup and every 2 weeks. Oh, that's pretty easy maintenance. Every 2 weeks? I can do that. This stuff looks delicious. I don't know if I can show you guys. You can kind of see it's brown. It's gross. One. Do I need anything else in here for information? Tip, set your light hood to the lowest position when starting. All right, down you go. Okay, I guess I'll keep this just because it does have some good information. And then we're just gonna put our little thing back in. And this is it. This is my arrow garden. Very cool, I can't wait to see how well it works. I mean, like I said, we do have it at the Nature Center and it does work great. So I can't wait to see how well it works for my stuff. All right guys, so that is my new Aero Garden all set up. I'll be sure to post progress of it on Instagram. So be sure to follow me on Instagram so you can see how my little garden is growing. And then so you can see us feed the leaves to like Arcadius, Tansy, and um, Chalupa. So yeah, thank you guys so much for joining me for another video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button because that room tour is next. You guys have been waiting forever, over a year now. So be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss it. And as always, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you for the next video. Bye.